Scotland is a dynamic country and the places around us are always changing. Decisions about how land is used and how places change matter to us all. The planning system decides how we use land in the public interest. Decisions like where homes are built, how we move around, and even the technologies that we depend on. Our historic environment is like a book that's still being written, telling the story of these decisions and developments. At Historic Environment Scotland, we're here to help manage change. Some planning decisions can also affect our heritage, whether it's built or buried. Impacts might include physical changes, changes to setting, or they might affect our cultures or communities. Who makes decisions? Your local council or National Park Authority make most decisions in the planning system. They are called planning authorities. And they listen to members of the public, applicants and consultees like us when making decisions. They use development plans to show how places should and shouldn't change. Planning authorities also decide most planning applications for development. Sometimes proposed changes need more permissions, such as listed building consent. Planning authorities usually make these decisions too. Changes to scheduled monuments always need permission. We make the decisions on those proposed changes. And some developments need permission from the Scottish Government, such as major road, rail or energy developments. What is Historic Environment Scotland's role in planning? We list buildings, schedule monuments and designate places that are special to Scotland's story. Recognising places in this way means that planning authorities need to consider the things that make these sites special before any changes are agreed. As a key agency in the planning process, we also work with other public bodies to help planning authorities create development plans that shape where we live, work or relax. We are a statutory consultee. This means planning authorities need to ask us for advice before they make decisions on development proposals if they affect historic places. Our advice is based on national planning policy and professional judgment. We also produce guidance to help decision makers understand how developments could affect historic places and we help identify opportunities for regeneration. Sometimes we will object to a proposed development because of its impact on the historic environment. Where we do this, it is because the impact is of national interest. In these situations, the Scottish Government may decide to make the decision. Working together. Good planning decisions need everyone to work together. And the earlier people give their views and the more people get involved, the greater chance that planning decisions work for everyone. Scotland is dynamic. Change has always happened and will never stop. How we work together is the key to making the planning system work for everybody by learning from the past, responding to current needs, and by looking to the future. To find out more, visit historicenvironment.scot.uk